This is how you can create a mass unbanned command for your discord.js version 14 bot, so let's go ahead and get started. Before I show you how to do this, I'd like to say if you'd like to get the code from this video and other videos on my channel, you can do so by joining my channel memberships or a subscription over on Discord. On YouTube, if you get the super god or custom bot tier, you will get access to that source code. And over on Discord, if you get the god or custom bot tier, you will also get access to that source code. And of course, on both platforms, if you get the custom bot tier, me and my team will code you a personalized custom Discord bot. If any of this is interesting to you, go ahead and click the link in the description below to get started with this and let's go ahead and get into the video so we can go over to moderation and we can go ahead and create mass unbanned.js in here we can do const and we can do slash command builder and we can do embed builder and we can also do permissions bit field and then we can do equals require and we're going to get discord.js now we can do module that exports equals so we can go ahead and open this up we're going to get data and that is going to be new slash command builder we can go ahead and set a name and that is going to be mass unbanned we can go ahead and set a description and in here we can say unbanned everyone from the server and then we can add a comma and we can do async executes and we're going to do interaction and then we can go ahead and open this up now we're going to go ahead and start off by getting the options so we can do const and we're going to get options and then we can do equals interaction now we can actually also add the guild to this as well so we can pass that in now we can do const users equals await interaction dot guild dot bands dot fetch and then we're going to go ahead and map the users so we can do const ids equals users dot map and we can do u arrow function u dot user dot id so now that we have all of the user IDs that we can use to actually unban, we're going to go ahead and make a permissions check. So next, we're going to go ahead and come back up here, and we're actually going to go ahead and pass in our owner ID just like that. And then after doing that, we can come down here and say if, and we're going to do interaction.user.id is not equal to owner ID. Then we can go ahead and return waived interaction.reply, and we can say content, and then we can say you have to be the server owner to use this command and then we can go ahead and make this informal just like this now basically what we're going to do is we're going to actually check to see if the member is the owner just to make it a little bit more secure um, so I would recommend doing this. Now the server I'm going to be testing this on, I do not own and it has been rated. A friend gave it to me so I could use it for this video. So I'm going to actually remove this before I test out this command, but just make sure you add this in so that an admin can't just abuse this and unban everyone from the server. Now we can do if no users, then we can go ahead and return await interaction.reply. We can say content and we can say there is no one banned in this server and we can go ahead and make this informal as well. Now we can do await interaction.reply and we can say content and then in here i'm just going to go ahead and get a loading emoji We're basically deferring a reply here so you could defer a reply if you'd like but this looks a little bit better so i'm going to do this instead we can say unbanning everyone in your server and then we can say this may take time if you have a lot of banned users and that's all we have to do there next we can actually go ahead and create a for loop so we can unban everyone by mapping their id so we can do for and we're going to do const id of ids and then we can go ahead and open this up inside of the for loop we can do await guild dot members dot unban and we can go ahead and pass in the id variable we just created then we can do our catch and we can do error and then we can go ahead and open this up and we're going to do return interaction dot edit reply and then we can say content and in here we can just go ahead and pass in error dot raw error just like that so after that we can actually do const embed and then we can do new embed builder now we're going to go ahead and set a color and that is going to be blue and we can go ahead and set a description and i'm going to do our white check mark and we can say ids dot length members have been unbanned from this server now we can actually go ahead and send this so we can do await interaction dot edit reply and we're going to do content and we're going to leave that blank and then we can do comma and we can do embeds and we can go ahead and get our embed just like that so with that we are actually done with this command so we can go ahead and restart the bot and test this out all right so as you can see here i am in a rated server now this was a server that a friend owns and he allowed me to use for this so as you can see here everybody is banned from the raid so it had about 108 members and they all got banned from the raid so we can actually go ahead and test out unbanning them this is going to be perfect because there's a lot of banned members so this will take a little bit longer so we can do mass unban and all you have to do is send it and as you can see it's going to say unbanning everyone in your server now i'm going to quickly go into bans as you can see it's slowly counting down it's actually pretty quick it's just unbanning everyone really really quickly as you can see it doesn't take much time like 100 
members are about to be unbanned within like 30 seconds and as you can see it's going to say 108 members have been unbanned and if we go back into the bands now it has zero bands so we can go ahead and test this out on another server a friend is letting me use this server has about 27 bands so this one should go pretty quick so we can go ahead and do mass unban and we can go ahead and send it and it's going to say unbanning everyone just like before and as you can see it's counting down and the bands are just now gone and it's going to say 27 members have been unbanned in this server and of course like i just showed you there are no bands now now keep in mind you may want to actually rate limit this command because it is possible that your bot is going to be flagged for api spam if a user were to use this over and over again but that would be very very unlikely as not many users have a big server with a lot of people banned but yeah so that's how you can code a mass unbanned system for discord.js version 14 bot if you need any help with this go ahead and join the server in the description below and we'll be happy to help you out and you might as well just join anyways because it is a pretty good coding community and with that i'll see you guys in the next video